one of the great gifts of this summer, just in terms of, you know, summer you want to read a book, summer you want to get some part of it, enrich your life in a way. I just was blown away by this. Life, Death, Love, and Freedom is the brand new CD from John Mellencamp. And I, quite honestly, I kept saying, where's the CD, CD? I got in the hotel room last night. I listened to every single song all the way through. And I'd, I felt like I'd just read a great novel or something. What was on your mind when you set out to make this? Well, all these songs were written in like 12, 15 day period. And it was just, I got up every morning and just wrote. And uh, sometimes I'd get a couple songs in a day and sometimes I would uh, get nothing. But uh, you know, that's a very short amount of time to write that many songs. They're very powerful stuff, and it sounds like it's from way deep inside. Well, it's in, in the American songbook tradition, you know, uh, going back to the 40s and the 30s and uh, looking at what material was written about then as opposed to what people are used to hearing songs written about now. Some of it seems like it's also plumbing some of the depths of your own psyche and soul. Well, a lot of people think this is a dark record, but this is really about life, you know. You can't talk about these things unless you've had a certain amount of life experience. And I said, that's why you'd like it. <laughs> Listen to this, though. This is from, there's so many, uh, almost every one I checked, I checked, I kept checking them off last night as I'm listening to them. Listen to the lyrics. It seems like once upon a time I was where I was supposed to be. My vision was true and my heart was too. There was no end to what I could dream. I walked like a hero into the setting sun. Everyone called out my name. Death to me was just a mystery. I was too busy raising up Cain. Well, that song actually, Stephen King and I are doing a musical and that song was actually written for the musical, but it was written for a 19-year-old kid, and we decided it, it was too, maybe too insightful for a 19-year-old kid to say, so we took it out of the show. Better for a 45-year-old man, maybe, yep. or 50 or 56. Yep. One last thing, you, everybody knows you're a big supporter of Barack Obama. How funny is it, though, that if you go to a John McCain rally, a lot of times you hear your song. Well, you know, they're, you know, conservatives are allowed to play whatever they like, you know, uh, but they should know that it's coming from a very liberal person.